chief secretary mr murugananandam industry secretary msc secretary kishan and all of them it's a, it has been a nice uh, discussion which is going on here this is the first time i have seen everybody interacting with the, the whole idea is to see how we can come back come back tamil nadu can come back in the industries as far as i am representing the industry as a leather industry sir we are one of the largest employment of uh, women workers in tamil nadu we have about 4 3 lakhs workers uh, employed in footwear sector alone women workers i am talking about for that in the whole of the headache of the elsewhere velu district now it is into three district the economy is controlled by this industry only i can tell you there is no agriculture there is no pd workers nothing is there now it is the industry which is supporting how we can continue that development how we can increase that that is what my thing i came into this business in 1964 1964 i came into the business more, more probably most of them would not have born that time i have seen how this industry was going in i have we have missed the bus once when china when the people shifted from korea and other places to china now a shift is coming from china to india and the brands international brands want to source from india so the first is to look after the industries which are there currently how to strengthen them how to import and them my my thing is sir is that we need a new industrial cluster to be established near the existing cluster sometimes when you tell them they say go to ravanadapuram and go to this place that's not possible there is no work culture there is no way it has to be a near natural cluster tamil nadu is a velur district is a natural cluster very high concentration of skills there that nearby we have to create and that also should be plug and play ready made say you will see a jump in the whole production and uh, employment on there secondly the other thing is that we need a women's dormitory to be supported by tamil nadu government should support on this women dormitory should be because 70% of employment is women and we have exhausted the women around 40 kilometers that is the highest time we can give them to come in a bus or something we cannot go beyond that but the people are there they want to work in this factories so we need a dormitory women's dormitory uh, to be established in that cluster and we will come out with a proposal i am sure that uh, minister is here and chief secretary is here who will give attention to that sir one one of the Uh, the biggest problem sir is the approval of the land approvals in the industries which has been existing there they say you should have applied before you already started it now you can't go through it you can't do that you can't come under a single window is okay for the new fresh industry what about the existing industries because they have to be given for say whatever the industries are located that land has to be given as a approval of the land approval has to be given as the industry's land that is very very important because we cannot sustain bank loans we can't go to any other uh, approval from central governments we need that land approval which is necessary and second a very important sir is as in the case of agra which is another big cluster of footwear they have declared white white category and white category is the footwear industry in their pollution control board pollution control board of up government has declared them as a white industry that is non polluting industry does not require so many of regulations it is highly necessary today for everything i had to go to the pollution board and you know that what are the difficulties they are facing with them without any pollution we have the headache so i chief secretary minister everybody is here please consider us moving us into the white category on the pollution control boards category is wise and next uh, and so I, a last one is that working workers training should be funded there must be more skill we should create and we have to be funded there sir these are the thing which we wanted for the uh, the one who want to come from china actually we are ourselves is negotiating with the big giant group in china and they want to come in then they say the land the thing the, all these problems they are finding it sir we must have a plug and play for at least separately for them lease this 250000 square feet to 400000 square feet they want for one factory that is the size of the factory they want it, it has to be there and there is some flexibility of a lot they want to ensure that so one idea i have got to tell you is this we must engage tamil nadu government should engage 
earnest we are making like uh, multinational companies for a reference for the, in the Tamil Nadu government's uh, facilities. That will make it easier for them to come, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you, Rafiji. Can I just uh, quickly? I, 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 I